Hello and welcome to today's cryptocurrency technical analysis where I have such a good one for you today. I'm feeling really, really, really positive, really happy, really content with how the trades are going. And today I am going to be sharing with you the trades that I am in, what I am looking towards next and exactly how I am approaching this market. So uh, yeah, let's just spread the positivity, spread the happiness and crush these charts together. Ladies and gentlemen, you're going to love the video. Just pay full attention to me because I am going to be teaching you to Today, you will learn something. Let's begin. Bitcoin, <laughs> the love of our life. I love this. You love it too. And it is trading Bitcoin and making money on this chart. I want to briefly, I will go over what is happening right now, the trade that I am in, and where I am looking to take it towards over the next few days. I will get to that towards the 5, 10 minute mark. I want to start off briefly talking to you via the last update that I done here on YouTube talking about Bitcoin. And it was back on the, you know, the 26th, 27th, when we were within this range, okay? We were trading within the daily resistance, which was back at $40,100 and the daily support there at $37,253. I just want to show you how this range progressed and how we have used the order flow to our advantage. Okay, this is the thing that I really want to teach you in today's video. So we can see back, this was on the 25th. I recognize these two daily levels, okay? Personally, we were in within a $900 range itself, e.g. we could be trading this $900 range. And I had identified very early on where that level of resistance was and where that level of support was. Really simply, I wrote to my team in the Discord, I am personally going to wait for a tap of either daily at the moment. This is where the good trades are. We need to be patient for the tap of the resistance for the short. We need to be wait. <laughs> we need to be patient to wait for the tap of support of the daily for long positions. Okay, so you can see very early on here, just keeping it simple, recognizing internal nine hundred dollar range, the scope trade, quick trades, the bigger trades, short off of the top daily, long off of the bottom daily. Okay, pretty simple stuff. Well, fast forwards two days, okay? Fast forwards, well, actually, the, the, this happened on the next day, as you will know from this one. We obviously come up, we tap the top of that daily with a nice swing failure pattern, obviously gifting us the short position, okay? From that short position, price built its way down to the low of the range. As you know, we also had the harmonic going on in here, where we went from low, high, low, high, back down to the low. I'll just add that on really quickly to remind you all. Obviously, had this really nice harmonic. That harmonic then brought you back up to the top of the range to take the high of C before coming back down to the low of the daily. Okay, so from the low of that daily, what happened? And this is where it's absolute, you know, of utmost importance to look at the order flow of what's going on here. This was from a champions live stream that I done literally just this Sunday past. We were moving down in that champions live stream. I said at the time. I am personally not going to long here at the moment. We need to remain patient. We need to wait for the order flow to switch bullish because at the time, live as it was happening, I was looking at the order flow on XO charts for the team. And I was telling them, this is this is not a time to long yet. We need to remain patient, okay? And at the, you know, my idea was, okay, the next level of support is the daily. This is a reactionary trade. I'm not going to preset along here, but if we get some nice order flow into level, I will, you know, that is an acceptable long trade. So it was, it was the case of making a plan Reminding ourselves this is the original level we've been waiting for for a few days. Now it's coming to fruition. Let's be prepared. Let's be ready. Let's check the order flow as it comes in. I want to show you here the order flow because it was quite outstanding what actually happened as soon as we tapped that daily. You can see up at the high. This was the high, by the way, that was made of this harmonic on the 27th of February, 1, uh, 1 um, p.m. UK time. On the absolute high of that move, you can see that we had 20 million positive delta, e.g. we were left with lots or 20 million trap longs at the very high of the move. What I found extremely interesting, upon hitting that daily, a level that we were planned and prepared for, we had the exact same scenario at the low. You see here 21 million negative delta at the very low of the move, leaving trapped shorts. So it was a case of, of acknowledging this is a level that we can be looking to trade. Let's wait to see what the order flow gives us. Upon hitting the low of the wick through the daily, we have over 20 million trapped shorts. This is what we wanted to see. From that, we start to get our market structure change. And of course, the massive volume that came through that pushing us back to the upside. Two long opportunities there. One was the first long aggressively off the daily. And in my opinion, the second long opportunity was a reclaim back into the old range. 
Okay, so there was two long opportunities there. And then obviously at the time, you're still thinking to yourself, hey, trade the range until it breaks. I can still be looking for a short opportunity at the top of that daily. But what happened this time? Well, this was beautiful as well. You actually had the absolute massive, massive, massive increase in volume through the top of the range. There was no short opportunity because really simply, you went through it like butter. You went through it like butter. And not only did you go through it like butter, if you were looking once again at that order flow, you see the massive increase in, in volume. Look at the volume there. We're looking here, 133 million, 143 million, 242 million upon breaking the range high. This is outstandingly big volume, cooped, coupled here with massive increases in, in open interest, nice positive delta. This is telling you there is no short opportunity here. This is what still while you were at 40,000, you know, just below $41,000, you know, you're recognizing this. You, if you understand what we teach, then you, you have to understand that there's no short opportunity yet. You've got to wait for higher or you've got to wait for the change in market structure. Change in market structure never happened. Really simply, you look for higher. This is what it looked like at the time. Sorry, wrong picture there. So what it looked like at the time, you know, you broke through the top of the range there, swift movements of the through, through the range high, really nice volume, really nice order flow. You know, the opposite of what happened here. Here, you had that increase and left them trapped here. You, you went through really, really strong, really massive volume. And what happens? Well, look at this. You go straight through the level. You never look back. And where did you come up to? You did not stop until we come and took that high, which is obviously the high that we took yesterday. Again, quite a simple kind of trade there. It was a, a simple case of a swing failure pattern. But right now, uh, we're obviously are building up these, these higher highs and, and higher lows coming into this level. I just want to do, uh, I think, just one announcement here. One announcement I want to do really, really quickly, and then we'll get back onto what's happening here. And that is that tonight we're actually doing a really special first time we've ever done it <laughs> live stream. And that is tonight for the contenders live stream. We're actually doing a mastermind round table. And this is going to be with all of the coaches. So myself, George, Victor, Eagle and Mike. The first time ever we are all going to come together on the stream. We're going to talk you through Bitcoin price action as it's happening. And basically you can be the fly on the wall looking into a conversation with some of the best traders in the world right now. You can be the fly on the wall and listen into our conversation. Have you know, a perspective of how we're approaching each other's ideas, how we're, you know, crit crit um, you know, critiquing the ideas, how we're coming to formulate our own plans. Again, this is five of the best traders in the world. We all have our own styles of trading and you can see how we're able to formulate our opinions, whether some things we'll agree on, some things we will not agree on and how we can come to, you know, approach the trading environment as it's happening live in the time. That is a really, really special one tonight that we wanted to give you. You know, really because of the fact we got the brand new learning platform out for you today. Obviously, if you haven't checked it out, you can go check it out now. It's obviously chartchampions.com. To celebrate that, we're giving you what you have requested for a long time. That's all of us together for the Mastermind Roundtable. If you want to see that really special live stream, that's obviously for all of the contenders, all of the champions. You can sign up now if that's interesting to you, chartchampions.com. That is the live stream that we will be giving you tonight. Personally, I am extremely looking forward to it. And that's one where I think the amount of golden nuggets, little things that you'll pick up on, it's uh, it's going to be amazing. What can I say? I fully am looking forward to that. So if you want to see that, that is tonight chartchampions.com for all of the members. It's going to be a good one. And that's the one and only announcement that I wanted to give you because, yeah, that's going to be fire. Uh, so bringing it back to Bitcoin. Oh, <laughs> bringing it back to Bitcoin then. As I was saying, we obviously come up, we took that high for the swing failure pattern. Personally, I did enter a short position off of that. I have already closed 75% of that short. Why? Well, because of the fact, you know, what's happening right here. This is not a picture perfect ascending triangle. But really simply what we have started to do is we are building over all these higher lows and we can see there's a really, you know, we even tested that high again yesterday for, you know, an absolute to the dollar move, by the way. But we can kind of see we are potentially, again, not picture perfect, but we're almost building this ascending triangle right now. So there's a few ways that we can look to approach this, of course. One option would be this kind of breaks down from here. And again, just because we break down from this does not mean it's going to crash all the way. We can just still look to the bottom of the range or a fake out. And the same way to the upside. If, if this does, you know, move its way back up to the high, there's a few ways that we can be looking at this. If we simply break, hold and move up, just like when we were looking at that daily and that daily went through like that. If it does something similar, we break out, 
you're brilliant. We look towards our next level to the upside. There's no short position to be had. But if it does do something such as breaking the high, you know, taking these highs, coming back into the channel, well, that's obviously giving us a really great short opportunity. So it's a simple case. Like I will always say, this is what we teach. This is the so important. We can be prepared for short positions, long positions. We've got our levels marked out. But what we are doing is we are really simply waiting for these reactions, okay? So if we have a level marked out and we see a nice wick and rejection, we're taking a short every day of the week. Okay, if we're ready and waiting for a long position off of the daily, okay, and we come down here, we see a wick through the level and the reclaim. You know, this is a very low term time frame chart. You can see the advantage and how really actually easy this is. You got your levels marked out, you see wicks onto the levels, you take the short. You have your level marked out, you see your wicks onto the levels, you're taking the long positions. And it's the exact same that's happening right now. We have our levels marked out. We know where we're going to be looking to long and looking to short. And we're really simply executing that trade. Okay. We combine this, of course, while looking at our order flow, because this is the secret source. This is the massive advantage that we're giving right now, because we're, we're not guessing. We're not thinking, oh, it might do this. It, you know, we, we, we're looking live at the evidence that's coming in front of us. We are able to exactly see how much volume's coming in. We're able to see exactly what the bigger players are doing. And that also refers to us right now, because if you haven't saw, we actually have the most volume in the whole of Bybit right now. We're trading billions of dollars that can be verified by Bybit. We have the so yeah, I mean, we know what we're doing and we can also see what the other players are doing in the game. And it's just a case of, you know, following the big money. And if you if you can tip the scales in your favor, hey, CC Paul will continue to send their regards. And for me, yeah, this is just brilliant. Um, you know, it's, it's really simply having those levels marked out, looking at the order flow. Once the alert goes off, is there a long opportunity? Is there a short opportunity? The answer is simply yes or no. OK, if you have examples like this where you wick onto levels, of course, the answer is yes. If you have an example like this where you go straight through the level, the answer is obviously no. OK, it's, you can see the, the, the big difference. If you have a level marked out, such as the daily, you want to know, do I short or do I long that level? If we wick onto it, look at this. This is obviously a yes answer. OK, combine that with looking at the order flow, which I just showed you. Of course, the answer is yes. 20 million trap longs at the high. If you just go straight through the level, of course, your answer is going to be no, because you went straight through the level. You know, it, it's actually very, very, very simple if you are educated enough to understand what's going on there. Whew. Well, what a video. I told you it was going to be a good video. I, I hope, really hope you've enjoyed it because I'm absolutely loving it. Um, so yeah, really simplistically, um, to make it a simple overview then of what we've just covered in this video, we are currently forming a bit of an ascending triangle. If we lose this ascending triangle, we can look down to the low of the mini range. If we break the low of that mini range, of course, we can look back to the daily possibly or lower. If we break from the high of this ascending triangle, we can either look for the fake out, just as both sides, we can look for the fake outs. Okay. And where you then simply would be trading the reaction. Have we got a swing failure pattern failed auction? Yes or no? The answer is simplistic. If we, if no, we look towards our next level to the upside around 46k. If, if yes, we do have a swing failure pattern, of course, we can short it. We're about to back potentially down to the low of this mini range again. So it really is actually a very nice trading environment. There is 100% money to be made on this right now. Uh, it's not overly difficult. Again, you have to be planned. You have to be prepared. You have to have the knowledge of what we're teaching to be able to take advantage of this volatility, of course. Otherwise, you know, if you have don't have that education, it's very likely you're probably losing a lot of money and you're more frustrated. Um, so, of course, I'll emphasize one more time. Chart champions, we are here. We are literally dedicated to you and improving you into making you a profitable, consistent trader. If you want to understand this, if you want to have access to our templates, if you want all of this, this is obviously everything that we offer within Chart Champions. Again, we got that live stream tonight, which I kind of think is going to be a massive one. Uh, if you want to see that with all of the coaches, you can come over to our website and and take a look, take a look and uh, start to educate and empower yourself today. Um, again, we are giving you the fish so you can you can make your own trades once you've got the knowledge. Uh, so, yeah, hope that you really, really, really enjoyed this video. If you have, smash that like button as hard as you can. Smash that like button to an all time high. And let's say again, I'll give you another opportunity. Get over 2000 likes. I'll bring you the altcoin video. It, you you got to want it, but you got to work for it. Show me that you want it. Smash that like button. 
<laughs> and uh, I'll see you over in the live stream tonight, everybody. Really hope you've enjoyed this one. And uh, hopefully you've walked away learning something with a big smile on your face, ready to crush the charts with us tonight in the live stream. So I'll see you in that. I just want to say thank you ever so much one more time and stay positive and cheers. Thank you. Bye-bye.